started with the wheel. Started with the wheel. Picture of the wheel on, on, on an underground challenger. And basically took the picture, cut it, stretched it on, on the computer and took a look at it and the body lines were great on it. So went down and got one, took all the interior out, cut it in half. And there's the product four and a half months later. The interior is completely different on it, obviously. We changed a lot of those things out. And it's black and red, the whole car, the whole theme of the car is black and red, there's no chrome. And it's got some red SRT stripes in it, in the seats, the door panels, 24 inch LED TV, 10 inch LED TV in the rear. Um, light show, color changing light show on the inside, full bar. Now is this a one of a kind? Uh, it is the first of its kind. It's not the last of its kind. We're already building the second one, and there's more thereafter. This was a large, steep learning curve. Um, adding another set of Challenger doors to the rear and making it to where they would work, and having glass cut, you know, for the rear doors, and making sure it's watertight, airtight, all using all factory rubbers, OEM parts, so the vehicle can be serviced in the field if it has to. If there's an issue. Personally, I've taken it to Vegas just to see, gauge the attention that it would get. We parked it in the uh, valet parking lot at the MGM next to the Phantom and the uh, Bentley, and it got more attention than the other two. People walk straight up to it, take pictures with it, as opposed to the Phantom or the Bentley. 